Eric Sargent at Martin Toyota. Just wanted to show you a comparison between two different Land Cruisers on the heights. This is a VP51 suspension with a 2721 spring in the rear, so basically no height, no, no lift in the back on the front. The shocks are set at the minimum, which is about a one inch lift. And then over here we have a uh, Heritage Land Cruiser. This one is a stock suspension, but it does have um, the OEM uh, spacers. Uh, which add about a quarter inch lift or so. So to compare the sizes on uh, how on the actual height of the vehicle, just kind of go on to the top of the of the window of the wheel well here. <clears throat> Again, the 2721 springs, so no no real lift. It's about a 38 and a half inch going to right here. The tires are uh, Terra Grappler G2, uh, 285, 65, 18s. Uh, net effective size of about 32 and a half inches on the front. Again, um, this is the lowest setting on the BP51, about one and a, one, well, about one and a half inches actually. 32 going to the top, to the bottom of the of the wheel well, and then come come over here to the uh, heritage, and again just the sock spacer in the front, nothing really in the rear. Um, this is sitting on a 32 inch tire. It's a Michelin uh, LTX AT2 275 65 18. Uh, height about 37 compared to about 38 and a half on the BP51 right next to it. And then over here on the front, uh, just a tick under 36 inches with a spacer on it. This is a comparison on how low can you go on the BP51. This is, this is what we're looking at here. I'll do a quick height from the top to the bottom to the top. So we're looking at a height right around 75, 75 or 76 inches from the floor to the top of the uh, to the top of the roof. Thanks for watching. If you have any comments, comment below. Please hit like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.